Jermichael Finley caused a bit of a stir yesterday when in a since deleted tweet he said athletes are looked up to and serve as role models leave personal opinions in race and politics alone do what you get paid to do and play obviously a reaction from Martellus Bennett and haha -Ha Clinton Dix amongst others who took issue with this tweet Robin is Finley's ask of athletes fair absolutely not look Mike, uh, Jermichael Finley is totally entitled to his opinion and to go about, you know, his life in that manner or his career when, when he was playing in that manner. But athletes are not robots. And to his actual opinion that he put out there about role models, if you were to ask me to succinctly describe a role model, I might say someone who is willing to stand up for what they believe in despite the repercussions and consequences. And that's the antithesis of what Jermichael Finley was saying. I feel like this is an old take. You know, I feel like this is the old way of thinking. And I know there are players now who, you know, this is sort of the norm for a long time. Guys wouldn't put their opinions out there. They wouldn't stand up for things that they believed in because I think they were afraid of the backlash that we're still seeing today. But also there was this sort of overarching theme of just, hey, go out there and shut up and play. And this is such a privilege for you to play this game for a living. That means that you are not entitled to the rights of what every other citizen has in this country. Country. And I think it's just outdated. I do. I mean, I think that this is this is something where I think we're past what Jermichael Finley is saying. And I think we're now looking at the people and the athletes who are willing to stand up and willing to take on that role of role model. I think we're looking at them in a different light. And people like Jermichael Finley, if they just want to stay in the back and just sort of do their job and, and not you know, dip their toe into any other circle or, or, or comment on anything else. All right, we'll do it. That's your right as well. Yeah, the notion of stick to sports is done. I mean, it's, it's really impossible to ask that of someone if you are wanting to totally deafen all of their human emotions or beliefs or feelings. Well, it's funny, you know, Robert Klemko, who we're going to talk to in just one moment, he writes, listen, if you want to use the stick to sports or sports as a distraction, then go get an Xbox and go play a NFL video game because these guys are not robots. <laughs>